Hello, thank you for joining me. I uh, went on a walk about today. I hooked up with Scott Wiles on the coast, and we went and looked at uh, it's actually some connect, a connect some connect, sorry, that, that, connective tissue uh, for a muscle on the coast. And uh, what I have is uh, tendon fibrils and lots of them. And um, this is basically a, a whole tendon, and, and you got the tendon fibrils inside the the collagen bundle itself. Uh, we're going to be what you're going to be seeing is lots of this right here. Oopsie, if I can get to focus, you're going to see lots of tendon fibrils like that, and like these, oopsie, I, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to find some good, better pictures that will show it, but you're going to be seeing a lot of this stuff in here, that I've shown right here, these fibrils, and uh, let me find something else here, okay, these are tendon fibrils in a bundle, uh, a bundle of them, that's inside the main bundle, <clears throat> so we're going to be seeing a lot of this stuff, this is muscle, but the tendon's similar to this the way it's breaking off in chunks. Um, and the way it, it kind of looks like cordwood. <laughs> I call it cordwood. The way it's stacked in. But that that's muscle. That's not tendon. But I'm just giving you, uh, uh, trying to show you what, you know, it, how it stacks in and how it lays. And we're going to be seeing fibers. Sim it's kind of similar to this right here. Okay, here's more here. But that's what, what you're going to be seeing is a lot of tendon fibrils. And it's on a scale that's just off the charts. I mean, you we you can't even imagine. I mean, it's just um, you could never see it on a on a scale like it is inside our bodies. What we're seeing now, this isn't too far away from the seven foot membrane, and also this is not too far away from the uh, rivers of blood, where I absolutely prove one hundred percent that this is not volcanic. Uh, if you haven't seen those three videos. I'll put a link in the description box to that that shows the 100% that it absolutely has nothing to do with vol volcanism or volcanic lava, anything like that. Okay, these are collagen fibers here. Uh, and you can see they just like, like pieces of rope all tied in bundles. Okay, you got collagen fibers here at the bone. See how these twist and turn right here? This right here? I know I'm not doing a very good job explaining this. I'm not happy the way I'm explaining it either. Uh, it's hard to find pictures to show what I'm trying to say here. Okay, here's some tendon fibrils. Showing an in shot of some of these here. Okay, these are going to be hard to see. I finally found some cross-section cuts of tendon. And these right here look really close, these two, to what we're seeing, going to be seeing. Especially this one right here. These two are really close to what we're going to be seeing. I don't know if those are showing up very good. But those are cross-section cuts of tendon. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and get started here a minute. You're going to be seeing a lot of this. Um, and they, A lot of them will be flat, and then you'll see them start to turn up as they start to change position. So I'm going to jump into it. And I'm just going to play one video after the other and just link them together. I'm not going to keep doing an intro, so I'll just link the videos together to play all the footage. Okay, right. I'm up on top of here, and we're looking at, this is a tendon where a muscle connected. It goes and turns out away right there, and that's what that whole thing is right through there. See that? It turns out about away from the main piece of the body. So I don't know if uh, it was an appendage off of it, or what it was, and what it might have operated something. I mean, I just don't, it's, it's hard to say. Hello, I'm back down here on a walkabout and uh, bringing you this tendon enthesis. This is a, I believe, a connective tissue for a, when a muscle would have been up on top above us. And uh, these are tendon fibrils, and I will show you this on it. I Googled some stuff, I'm trying to get across here and not. This is not volcanic in any way whatsoever. That's what. Geology would tell you and they would be 100% wrong I'll get down there and take a look at those here in a minute In fact, I'm gonna I don't know if I can get around through it this way, but these are the we're on such a, a scale that you can't even imagine um, Of these ten this tendon these tendon fibrils um, The muscle like I said would have been above us here geology would probably call this a um, 
a feeder dike um, where uh, the lava came up through and cracks in the crust and then glaciers scrubbed it off or something like that or eroded and that, that is not the case whatsoever um, Every, every, all those are te those are tendon those the fibrils laying in there right there that's a good example they look like those bands you see right there I'll get I got water in here now but I'll get down off here and get in there you got them all you got it all over in here and you'll notice as I go through here you'll see it laying flat and it'll start to twist and turn up and stand up straight um, in places so I'm gonna head on over here and I'll show you the stuff on I'll show you some uh, tendon fibrils uh, some uh, electron scanned tendon fibrils and you'll see what I'm talking about Let me shut this off for a second. Yay! Let me get across that Here's a good side shot of What it looks like from the side I plan on crawling up on there if I can find a spot to get up on there right here. Oh man. There's where they're standing up. They're not laying flat. See this? Right over here they're they're laying flat. Now, everything I'm showing you here today. Everything I've shown you in my videos, there is no working model on the planet for it anywhere. We have earthquakes, we got volcanic activity going off. If you go back and look since 1974, it'll blow your mind activity going on. Look at the charts they have. And you will find none of this anywhere. Why would you not, if we have volcanic activity everywhere, why would you not find any of this? Why would you not find any of this in real time? We got lava flows everywhere, we got fissures everywhere, but you won't find this. You won't find nothing like this. These are not feeder dikes. This is actually a tendon emphasis, I believe. Uh, the muscle would have been above, like I've said. It's biology. Here it turns and starts standing up, going from laying flat to turning to standing up. See right over here? starts angling and it's not flat no more see this all right here we got more here it gets really good over in here but you can see how these start angling and then uh, ends up like the bigger stuff on down there. It ends up standing up. The bones down below is somewhere. I don't know how far, how deep. I know it's going to be pretty darn deep. But, you know, a lot of people have been asking, how come you don't have any bone or nothing like that? Because we're not deep enough. We're not deep enough on the creature. You got to get down. I mean, if I got a membrane that's seven feet thick, you're going to have to go deep to get to bone. I'll get down in there. There's so much of this it's missing too. It's not here. Oh, it's slick. All right. Got all this twist and turn to go. You know, there's. <laughs> uh, calling it love. I'm sorry, I started laughing. 
how it, the angles it's laying in. Look how fibrous it is, man. Yeah. Now all this is, is it's, a, you know, how this, the, this tendon's constructed. You can tell how tough and fibrous, how, you know, it's falling apart, of course, you know, it's dead, but hard to walk on. Pretty killer. Get back down here. Now from the side, so it looks like it's just in here like cordwood. fall into that. <laughs> Now, the rivers of blood is not too far from here where I proved absolutely 100%. No one's proved to me yet that it's volcanic because it's not volcanic. And this is right beside it. This is not no feeder dike. The feeder dikes are calling feeder dikes aren't even feeder dikes. That isn't what they are. They're tending connection points. Entesis. Some of it's connective tissue. Most of it's coming. Well, it's still connective tissue, but. Wish that water was in there. Look at that right in there. I can still get up on there. Over here somewhere. Yeah, I want to get up on there. Alright, I gotta shut this off to get up there. Need both hands here. Yeah, maybe not. Getting too fat to be doing this. Come here. This up here is where I've been wanting to look at anyway. The way that oh, lay it in here. You start, sound like I'm coon hunting. Oh. All right, here I got her now. Get a closer look at these if I can without falling in that pond or that tide pool. You know, it's just laying in and it starts turning. See that in there? I've never been over here either. Look how fibrous that is.
okay believe it or not tendons look like this connect you know or connective tissue looks like this in your body our bodies too it's just so small we can't see it like you can see this climb up on that it's too dangerous all right battery went dead man I don't know if you can see that very well on the GoPro I don't, I don't know if I got a foca a telephoto on here put that right in there how that turns I'll get the other camera out. All right, I got the other camera. I just wanted to show you how, you know, stuff kind of, how it lays and turns. It's, um, be, you know, as it transitions to the muscles, what I'm trying to get at. It's not all going to be laying this way forever. It's going to be transitioning to the muscle. Got fog here today, so. Sorry about the fog. Got Scott Wells here. Wiles, I'm sorry, here today too. And like he said, it helps give that spooky, eerie feeling. <laughs> the ambiance. Okay, other camera. <laughs> 